With the Russia-Ukraine war passing the two-year mark, companies are trying to remain in production in the region. That includes the cookie brand Oreo, which is continuing to do business in both countries. Snack maker Mondelez International announced production has resumed at its eastern Ukraine plant for the first time since 2022, when the factory was damaged during Russia's invasion. The company says the plant is now fully rebuilt after partially opening last year to make chocolates. In a statement, the company says, we continue to increase our investments in supporting and rebuilding Ukraine. The eastern Ukrainian facility is crucial for supplying Eurasian markets, including countries like Georgia and Kazakhstan, which Reuters reports used to get their supplies from plants in Russia. The Ukraine plant does not export to Russia, but Mondelez does have three factories there as part of a recently crafted self-sufficient supply chain. This was a change that came as Mondelez faced backlash from the general public and shareholders with continuing business in Russia. In May 2023, Ukraine added the company to its list of international sponsors of war. Now Mondelez's Russian plants are being called into question again by investors. According to a company filing last week, more than 30 percent of shareholders are backing a resolution to conduct an independent study of the risk of continuing operations in the country. Mondelez has previously defended its business in Russia, saying that vacating the country would mean cutting off part of the food supply for many families who have no say in the war. Thank you.